In this episode, we will learn about the Eskimo bowline. It is another variation of the common bowline. Some people classify it as an anti bowline because the bite is formed on the eye or loop instead of the standing part. Here is how to tie an Eskimo bowline. With the working end, create an underhand loop. Take the working end and pass it through the loop from the bottom. Instead of running the line behind the standing part, run it behind the loop just formed. Take the working end and run it through the underhand loop from the top. Tighten the knot by pulling the loop and the working end together. The key difference between the common bowline and the Eskimo bowline is the bite. With the standard or common bowline, the bite is formed at the standing part. With the Eskimo bowline, the bite is formed at the eye of the loop. The Eskimo bowline is quickly and easily tied, and best used in applications in which the loop will be stretched wide. In applications where the two legs of the loop are nearly parallel, a bowline is superior. The Eskimo bowline is also known as the Cossack loop, Stika loop, and Anti bowline. 